Hello everyone, how are you today? In this video, I will show you how you can compress a large PDF file. Perhaps you've been struggling with a large PDF file. You can watch this video and see how you can efficiently compress your PDF file without losing its quality. All right, so head over to your browser and type in pdfgear.com. All right, when you type in pdfgear.com, you're going to find um, something like this, uh, free download. So it's a free app that you can download to your computer and then um, install to your computer. All right, click on that and then you have it downloaded. I'm going to walk you through on how you can set up this um, app on your desktop. Okay, you can see once you have downloaded the um, setup file, you will see it by your download folder. Um, double click to install the app. So we'll go through the process together, okay? English, yes. Um, welcome to PDF Gear Setup Wizard. Let's go next. Uh, accept, next. Okay, over here you can choose a different folder where you would like um, the setup file to be installed, but let's leave it as it is and click on next. If you don't want any of those, you can just um, take off the ticks there. So I'll uncheck that one and just leave the desktop one. Click OK. And then we click Install. Great, it's now installed, so we click Finish. Once the installation is completed, this came out automatically letting you know that um, there is a successful installation. So I'm just going to minimize this and then go straight to the app. So on your desktop, you will see the app that you have just installed. Here it's um, PDF gear. So this is it. Now from this point, you will see different things you can do with your PDF. You can convert PDF to what? You can um, work to PDF, PDF to PNG, image to PDF. Uh, you can compress your PDF. You can merge, you can split. This is a great app and it's completely free. So let's try to compress a PDF. I have a large PDF document. Um, let's compress it. So over here at different tabs, um, do well to click on them to see what you can do with those. But if I go to that point, you'll see different things you can do convert from PDF, okay? You can see Excel, PNG, PDF to JPEG, PDF to different file um, extensions that you can convert. So let's um, convert to PDF, all right? These are things you can do. You can merge and split, okay? So these are hot tools. Let's go to the compress PDF. So when I click on the compress PDF, now those two comes out. Okay, you let's look towards the downside compressed level. If you want it to be low, you can choose that low. If you want medium, I think by default is medium. You can also choose high. So let's leave by default there. Okay, right. So at this point, I'm just going to drag the large document that I want. It's a proceedings, or I can call that a test book drop and dump it there. As you can see, the file size here is 15.31M, so that's large. Now we can compress. Okay, once it finishes compressing, you will see it opens a new um, folder and um, downloads that particular document for you. Okay, you can see the current size here, but let's go to the app itself so we can see what the compression is like. Okay, now you see the original file size. It was 15.31M and when compressed, it's like half of it. Okay, and once it finishes, it's going to download it automatically like you saw initially download automatically and then open the folder up for you. Now that is the document and the file size is now reduced. Isn't this wonderful? Isn't this wonderful? This is a great app and it's completely free of charge. And it's not just about compressing your PDF. Okay, there are several other things that you can do. What to PDF, Excel to PDF, 
PowerPoint to PDF, image to PDF, different file extensions that you can convert to PDF. Yeah. There are a lot of um, online version that you can use to compress your PDF file. But this is nice, smallpdf.com. Um, so go to your browser and type in smallpdf.com. Now when you get to, when the web, the site opens, scroll all the way down. There are several things that you can do here. All right, take your time to look at it. Now let's look at the PDF aspect where um, compressed PDF, click on that. Now this comes out. You can now drag your large PDF document and drop it there. Okay, or you click here to select the particular document that you want to compress from your local device. Okay, so I have a large PDF document. I will just drag and dump it here. So I drag and dump the file over there. So you can see that it's uploading. Okay, now this is, um, I'll call this a test book or a proceeding. Okay, now there are two options here. You will see the basic one, which is free, uh, medium file size, okay, standard resolution. So it's going to be standard. The, the printing and everything will be fine. You can go with that and click on the compress. Or you can go to use the strong version. If you click on that, um, small file size, lower resolution. So this depends on what actually you want, okay? I think the the website um, recommends the basic one, which is medium, so that you would retain the standard resolution of your PDF file. Okay, now if you decide to choose the smaller one, all right, you can see that you only have access to use it once, okay, for free, then you click on the compress and it will further reduce your PDF and it's not like uh, the resolution, you can't read what is there, you'll still be able to read it. Okay, so this is it. It's that simple when you finish, um, click on the compress and then download your document when you are done. So I'm not going to be um, compressing this document. Okay, so I just wanted to show you how you can use an online version to compress your PDF file should you not want to download the app that I previously showed you onto your desktop. Okay, everyone, I hope this video helped you. If you found it interesting, and please hit the like button, subscribe and share. Drop comment for me in the comment box as to what kind of video you would like to see me produce going forward. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.